Boogie drop that beat. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Talking Out Loud with Miss Talkative. Everything I say is my own opinion, alleged, and strictly entertainment purposes. Remember, I'm just talking out loud. Please like, share, subscribe. Comment on the video, let me know what you think. Now, I was on Melody's live earlier today when she was speaking out about the millimeters. And she didn't come out and say it per se, but I'm going to assume, I'm going to, my opinion, that people are asking her to, two down the millimeters and Melody stated she not stopping anybody from loving on her and I'm like okay that's right Melody now I'm gonna let y'all hear the clip and I'm gonna come back and give my opinion That's right, Melody. She said she ain't about to pull back the love people got for her. She ain't going to be able to do it. And I don't blame her. Because these people, they were gone ho when, you know, they thought that they were getting the best of her and um, acting like they was like she was their punching bag. So my question is, which one of y'all hate no Melody support system? Carlos? Was it you? Scott's 1.0, 2.0. We I mean, was it y'all that's telling telling her to uh calm down her supporters? Betty and Stormy. I I know y'all, you know. I know it wasn't y'all, because you know y'all bought it bout it. Cause Betty said she pull up. And Stormy, she, you know, she act like she about that life. So, was it y'all? I wonder, was it own network themselves? Because seems like all of the uh, the uh, Carlos shows, the ratings are going down. People, y'all don't realize that people are tuning in. For Melody. Melody supporters are watching all of these shows and y'all didn't take that into account. But anyway, I mean, well, we know it wasn't Martel. I mean, well, we already know that he, you know, he's the biggest hater, so we don't even have to ask. Cause he never wanted her to have any type of support. So I don't even have to ask him. Was it him? But I mean, because we already know that. He is anti-millimeter all the way around. But I wonder, was it Wanda? You know, because all she could think about is the ATMs. And, I mean, she always, you know, uh, trying to put the ATMs against the millimeters. She loved talking about the millimeters and her family, her family tree falling apart. So, mm, I wonder, is it Wanda? That's why she trying to, you know, make it seem like, oh, me and Mel cool. Nah, nah, Wanda. I see you. But I'm just curious. 
maybe it was all y'all that tried to talk to her. Y'all probably called a secret meeting trying to um, ask her to try to calm her supporters down. But from y'all, I thought one monkey don't stop no show. I thought y'all didn't care what the millimeters did or said. I wonder, is it because all the stuff um, about y'all be, is being exposed and it's true? Is it because y'all characters are really being brought to light? Because the stuff, the way y'all portray yourself on the show is not really y'all? Hmm. Well, what have Melody um, try to calm down her supporters? Why not just have the T-Squad in the scenes still or step up to the plate? Y'all can't activate y'all squads? But anyway, I'm glad y'all hearing the noise and feeling the burn from the millimeters. But the sad part about it is y'all still haven't learned anything. Y'all still, you know, continuing to try to push her buttons and disrupt her peace. So why do y'all feel as though that the millimeters need to calm down? Because as, as soon as y'all feel as though Melody supporters aren't watching y'all, y'all do some dumb stuff like, you know, sneaking indirect friends on the show, copying her brand, duplicating all her looks, and attacking her for no reason on and off the show. But you want her supporters to calm down? Why? Y'all know Melody can't have eyes and ears everywhere to catch her back. So she has a she has a, a support system to help her weed out y'all snake snakish hypocritical moves. Mm, and y'all don't like that. And and but it didn't even have to be this way because the viewers were here for everybody when the show first started. And they and it's mighty funny that majority of them viewers. Then just moved right on over there to Melody. The same person that y'all was attacking, using as a punching bag, and didn't even try to protect. So you get what you get when you get it. So before y'all ask her to calm down her supporters, y'all need to understand why. Well, I need to understand why y'all feel so threatened by her. Y'all need to ask yourselves why you don't have a support system as strong as Melody's. And ask yourselves, what can you do different to have a great loyal support system and start winning? Hmm. I know y'all wondering. But once y'all look in the mirror and answer those questions truthfully, y'all would know exactly why. Her support system is so loyal and strong as they are. Y'all already know, but because y'all thought it was, you know, it was just her by herself and she had no way of fighting back. She she didn't have a way to fight all y'all back at one time. Y'all felt as though it was cool. But now y'all see she's not by herself. She may be by herself on that show, but she's not truly by herself ever. So, all I can say is, Tisha, never underestimate your enemy. Ain't that what you said? You, you called Mel your enemy. So, I'm going to say, never underestimate your enemy. And I'm just stating my opinion, talking out loud. Please like, share, subscribe. Comment on the video. Let me know what you think.